Welcome to a review of support resources offered by Silicon Labs. Silicon Labs offers three main sources for information on wireless mesh networks. Documentation that comes with our stacks, the online community forum, and our portal where a user can create a case. Let's briefly look over the documentation available so if you have questions about our stack or development kits you will know where to look for help. The first place to look is under our documentation folder in the Ember ZNet stack root directory. In this directory you can find the index.html file which lists links to all the documentation provided with our stack. We have six areas of focus. The release notes and quick start guide section We'll have notes on the latest changes to our stack and a setup guide for our development kit. A list of data sheets and technical specifications of our chips and development tools. Application framework documents for our application layer. This is likely where you will spend a lot of time. Application development fundamentals, which has a series of users guides on development of wireless mesh networks with our chips. This is a great place to start. Application notes for specific components of our solutions, such as programming options, manufacturing testing guidelines, bringing up custom devices, etc. Utilities guide is documentation on our software used with the ISA3. Ember Desktop also has its own user guides within its directory and covers using App Builder to configure your application and how to use Ember Desktop to capture network traffic. If you have exhausted the help of the documentation, we have a few places online where you can seek out clarification. Silicon Labs has a constantly updated knowledge base. Knowledge base articles, or KBAs, are posted by our engineers covering everything from why do I get this error to frequencies used in the EM35XIC? KBAs are searchable online and do not require access. Silicon Labs also has a community forum where any question can be asked by any registered user. Questions can be answered by other community members or Silicon Labs employee moderators. If the question or issue is more complex, and requires divulging proprietary information, we will recommend moving the conversation to our customer portal. This portal is private to your company. A user can create a case where one of our engineers will assist with the solution to your problem. Other engineers from your team will also be able to view your case history, making communications on solutions easier. In order to gain access to the community forum or portal, we require first self-registering at siliconlabs.force.com slash sl underscore communities self-reg. By registering, you will also get release notes and software update notifications. Our software can also be downloaded from the portal. To get access to our software, Please post a case asking for access and adding the software serial number from your purchased Silicon Labs development kit in the description field. More information and help can be found in our active online community at http colon slash slash community.scilabs.com. Thank you.